Madam Ping? And Cloud Retainer? It appears you made haste after all. One arrived but moments before you. Oh, bless my soul. To what do I owe the honor? How nice of you all to come and visit me. Miss Illuminated Bird, haven't you said anything yet? Said what, precisely? And why should one be tasked with saying it? Cause you're the one who's known Madam Ping the longest. <sighs> Street word. <clears throat> or rather, presumably, you would prefer to be addressed as Ping? Oh, <laughs> Cloud Retainer, you are uncommonly polite today. One, uh... uh... Given that Lantern Rite is almost upon us, the weather in the city is most pleasant, and a sweet floral fragrance lingers in the air. <clears throat> Gone you, please continue from here. Huh? Uh, all right. So, this all started because we were trying to help Mr. Dvorak find the Adeptus who saved his ancestor's life. Cloud Retainer informed us that the one who played that melody and rescued the drowning man was none other than yourself. Ah, huh. let me think. Yes, I do believe I recall that encounter. Uh. What a long time ago that was. I'm surprised that you still remember it. Even more astonishing, perhaps, is the fact that this story has survived this long at all when mortal lives are so very brief. <laughs> it appears that she has proven herself right once again. Who's she? We like to call her Gui Jong. From the look in Cloud Retainer's eyes, I sense that she has already told you all about her. <sighs> Albeit reluctantly, one might add. Oh. <laughs> there is no harm done, after all. Lantern Rite's very purpose is to commemorate the heroes who gave their lives for Liyue. -e. Although Gui Zhong did not live to see the splendid sights of today, she was as much a hero as any other. Uh, so how has she proven herself right again exactly? Once upon a time, she said to me that humans were a weak form of life that she wished to protect with her wisdom. But as she interacted more and more with them, her opinions on them began to change. She marveled at the beautiful complexity of their spirits, the sheer splendor of all they could accomplish through their hard work and intelligence. She told us that to underestimate human potential would be to make a grave mistake. With the smallest amount of guidance, enormous power can be unleashed in them, and a human, who has reached their full potential, may well be her equal. Someone who could have as much to teach an Adeptus as to learn from them. Hm. She always had a way with words. That her mechanical accomplishments were judged superior to one's own was... One suspects, in large part due to her sheer eloquence. Speaking of mechanics, Cloud Retainer, do you still remember that potted plant mechanism? The one that the two of you gave me as a gift? Of course. Gui Zhang and one both put an immense amount of effort into that gift. It would be no overstatement to call it a testament to each of our individual technical genius. As Gui Zhang once said, it takes every blade of grass and every flower to make a homeland. When I see the sight of Liyue Harbor before us today, I am reminded of this. Madam Ping looks very emotional right now. <sighs> of all of us, it was Gui Zhong who was the fondest of these grand and exciting occasions. <sighs> If she were still with us, I'm quite sure she would still be trying to best Cloud Retainer's finest works at every opportunity. Liyue Harbor is always filled with the sound of music at this time of the year. If she were here, 
One is... Oh, yeah! Music! We've been dying to ask. What was the melody that you played back then? Oh, also, with you being such a music expert and all, why don't you join the concert as a performer? I can make arrangements right away. Oh. As much as I don't wish to dampen your enthusiasm, it's been a long time since I played this zither. My fingers don't have the dexterity they once did. And whenever I play that tune, it always reminds me of her. I start wondering what she would think of the changes I have made to her melody. There was a period of time whenever I started strumming, it almost felt like she was back again. Sitting right there on the stone stool next to me, chatting away. Skybracer and Seagazer too, looking just like they did in the old days. No matter how much time goes by, the moment that melody starts playing, it transports me right back to that time in my memory. So the past still weighs heavily on your heart? No. Oh, I would be lying to myself if I claimed to have completely moved on. But that is not to say that grief doesn't get easier with time. Despite the sadness, I have found many things that bring me joy in life. It is simply the nature of the world in which we live that, even if one wished to mourn for an eternity, it would be a nigh-impossible feat. Just look at this potted plant. Isn't it stunning? It takes an honest and open mind to confront and conquer grief. You have indeed made progress. <laughs> be that as it may, I shall leave the lantern right stage to the youth of today. Well, if you're sure... Granny! <laughs> Whoa. What's everyone doing here? Did something bad happen? Ah, uh -huh. and now we've spooked Yanfei. <laughs> no, no. Everyone's just here to give me their regards for the holiday. Oh, that's wonderful. I'm glad. Well, in that case, happy lantern ride, everyone. Happy lantern ride. Oh, I... I just remembered that I have some... Uh, work to do at your high pavilion that I need to discuss with Yenfei. I haven't been able to find a chance until now. I will leave Mr. Dvorak in your capable hands. Cloud Retainer, Ping, we will be off for now. Huh? Does it have to be right now? Which case is this again? Hey, Ganyu! <laughs> it seems Ganyu still has much to learn when it comes to the art of deception. What a pity. She has learned nothing of one's ability to carry a conversation. Since it's been so long, Cloud Retainer, why don't you stay? I'll make a cup of tea and we can chat a while. Gladly. This was one's intention as well. When you next see the Fontaine musician, please give him my regards. I'd like to wish him the very best with the concert. You got it, Madam Ping. Thank you all. I think you've listened to enough of my nattering for one day. As for that melody, I will play it for you all another time. <laughs> Goodness knows I need to practice it first. Wow, that'd be great! We'll look forward to it! <laughs> when that time comes, wherever her spirit may be among the countless grains of sand and specks of dust between the harbor and the mountains, perhaps... She will look at the Liyue of today and steal a smile when she sees the prosperous land that it has become. <laughs> <laughs>